10, 10, 11. We're gonna find 10 arrowheads a piece, right? You got it, man. <laughs> I got for one, but <laughs> yeah, me too. 10 would be great. Yeah, I won't get greedy. Look here, I just went over to get the camera, found four leaf clover. Well, I figured we better make a little intro video. I got a little pile of stuff going here. Richard's got a pretty good little pile of stuff already going. We've only been at it maybe an hour. He's got a broken drill down there and he pulled three tools out right away. It's pottery. He's got a pretty good hole going already. I'm still digging over in the trash pit. Look at there, Cody Clintworth. That's another auger bit. Hey, hey, hey. Okay, we'll get back with you whenever we find some good old points with ears and tips and all that good stuff on them. Okay, it's probably five minutes since I checked in with you all ago. I had this, this is actually the same clump of dirt that the uh, auger came out of. Matter of fact, right there is the outline of where the auger was at. And I was busting up these clumps of dirt here. And I got a got a little arrowhead in there. So I'll uh, I'm gonna leave it there. Richard said he wanted to take some video of it. So I want to thank Creek Dalton for coming out. I think we're gonna have a pretty good day today. We're just getting yeah, things kicked off. Here. Well, I was down there just fooling around. I was trying not to move too much dirt, as you can see. Wait, waiting on Richard to find one. Just waiting around, you know. Oh. <laughs> Look at this. Piece. And I, he came up with one, and it's a pretty good one, too. It's got a nice base on it. My it's goodness. Cool. It. Hey, it's a little on the thick look, side. Look at the color at it, though. It's got some blues and some grays. Kind of speckled one. A little white. Yeah, a little stack there, but hey, you know what? Hey, that'll look beautiful base, in a case. I was going to say the base makes up for all that. That's a cool base. Yes, sir. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Bit on this before I saw the bottom, the base is damaged, but it's got a nice tip on it. Yeah, it's still got the ears on it, doesn't it? Well, it has kind of a crazy ear on it. It know, didn't wondering. even have an ear on that side. I'm wondering if they didn't kind of work that down that way, using it just like it was. That's a little pink drill. Hey, there we go. Well, oh boy, there's a nice tip sticking out there. Yeah, but I don't know if it's going to be whole. Why don't you go ahead and do well, the honors? There it is, the way it's hanging in there, but you do the honors. Nope. No, it's a tip. Broke. Oh well. Never know. It's a nice tip. It would have been. An hour, hour and a half. It's been a bit. Richard's on fire. I just actually pulled this up out of a hole. There's a fire rock, a little piece of fire rock oh, right next to it. It's going to be an Apple Creek. And I heard something crunch and hopefully it was the fire rock and not the It was point. the fire rock. Oh, oh you got just a God tip, but dang it. Man, that is a nice <laughs> one. What a freaking point. Man, that is awesome. That's what I'm talking about. Just a hair. There you go. Oh, you, cool. can, you put a little bubble gum on that and that'd fix it. <laughs> on the groove dax anywhere, ever. Well, I haven't either, actually. We don't find those down south. But that's definitely what that oh, is. Oh, my goodness. I've been on the hunt for that thing. By God, they used the hell out of it and wore it out. They did. It's pretty beat up but look at the pole and everything like that is a really nice three-quarter groove yeah it's a really nice pole God. ain't that something you gotta have that man. nah man I, it's a thrill of finding them I appreciate that you don't know how much that means to me you'd be willing to give it to me but that's uh that's pretty cool man uh you know it was hanging out of there anything large may not be anything may just be a big old tool awful work looking. Holy guacamole. That's what it is, this big old tool. It's a fine one though. It's almost big like old a hoe or something, yeah, a spade or a hoe or something. All right. Okay guys, we got her all home, cleaned up. I'd say that was probably Richard's find of the day. How many years did you say it had been hunting? 31, actually 32 years of hunting. 32 years of hunting and he'd never found one. We so just it's don't only get those down there 
only fitting that he found one. He got a real nice Apple Creek. Huh? That's, that's a good one. I like all the fossils in it. Overall, we had an excellent, excellent day. You just can't beat the kind of day we had today. There was a little bit of all kinds of action going on. The weather was beautiful. There's my big spade or chopper or whatever you want to call it. Got another auger bit. Turned out pretty cool. Got some kind of odd rock here that, I don't know what they were using that for. Pigment rock, I would guess. And got a few brokes and there's my old lonely dude, my little knife. I'd say an exhausted point from where I found it in the trash pit. So, Richard, I want to thank you again for coming and hanging out. Thank I had a good much, time. Man. He was so kind as to give yeah, me a brand time. new, brand new wiggle yeah. pick. And so I really appreciate that. If you guys don't have a wiggle pick, you need to get in touch with him and get you one. They're a lifesaver. All right, thank everybody for watching, and I appreciate all the kind comments.